hi everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome to my old and returning subscribers you guys has been amazing and if you are just seeing my channel for the first time my name is benita feel free to join the family and also click on the notification bell to get notified anytime i post a new video so this is a requested video by one of my subscribers and she said i should talk about the different types of uh, lace glue and what they are used for yeah, what they are used for so your wish is my command so here is the video and for those two that that want to know the different type of glue because you might have been seeing this product this uh, product i'll be talking about in the market but you don't know what they are used for and also it is very important to have any one of these products that i'll talk about especially if you are a frontal uh, 360 uh, uh, lace wig uh, lover or those braided wigs yes that they use they make with a uh, frontal you know you need glue to style it to make it stay put and to make it well laid and last long for you make it neater so lace glues are very very important for your even closures as well if you really want your closures to look more natural like frontal you can use lace glue as well so lace glue is very very important for frontal lace uh, 360 uh, 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 weeks lover so in today's video i'll be talking about the ones that are very uh, popular and common in the market and are also uh, affordable as well so if you are interested in knowing this uh, glue that i want to talk about in this video keep watching first one i'll be talking about today is uh, the first lace glue although this is not a lace uh, glue it and it is called a uh, got to be freeze uh, spray like this product is one of the most beginner friendly uh, product i know for laying frontal lace wig or any type of uh, this, uh, frontal or closure that you want to use so got to be spray is so beginner friendly and you must have been seeing this product everywhere and in fact it's one of the, my favorites when it comes to you know styling frontal or 360 weeks because it makes it very easy for you as a beginner like it's like i said it's a beginner friendly product and it's not why i love this spray that is not heavy on the air and it will stay put you know for the number of uh, time that you want to use that you want to you know wear the frontal or whatever the uh, 360 you feel like you want to wear but it is very beginner friendly and it's very very easy to use you just spray it you know uh, it's very good like a, a temporary uh, use and it's not heavy on the hair because you know some lace glue can be very very heavy that you know when you apply it you you know you, it, it makes you your front your frontal feel heavy you know that you apply something on your hair but why i love this product is that it's very very lightweight and it's beginner friendly so if you are a beginner and it's very easy to use so if you are a beginner and you are, you are starting you know you want to start laying your your frontal or making your, your closure look like frontal or your 360 i really recommend this spray for you because it's very very easy to use but it's just that it doesn't really last for a long time like maybe for days for weeks ahead it doesn't really last like that but if you just want it's very good like for a temporary use for example maybe if you want to remove that uh, frontal that same day or your 360 that same day i really recommend this spray for you just for like a very short period of time you know which even me personally i prefer it like that because i don't think i can stand carrying my frontal for days because it kind of makes me you know feel heavy and uh, my head me feel heavy so this is a spray that is beginner friendly it's also uh, affordable but although it depends on the and it comes in sizes it comes in uh, small medium and big so it depends on the one that you can afford but it's not too expensive i think it ranges between maybe three thousand naira to six thousand naira so it depends on where you are buying and it depends on the size that you are buying but this is a very beginner friendly uh, uh, lace uh, spray that i really recommend and it's popular it's common everywhere so it's very easy to find but it's just that 
I kind of feel that there are fakes of this spray. So you have to be careful where you are buying this spray from. So this brings me to the next one, and it's also a, a, the same, a, the, the same brand but different uh, product. So the one I'll be talking about, the second lace glue that you can get in the market is a lace, is a got to be glue. Yes, got to be glue. First of all, it comes in two types. You can get it in black and also, which I'll be leaving pictures for you to see. You can get it in black. You can also get it in a, a yellow a container and it also comes in sizes, small, medium and big. So, let me start with the, the, in the yellow uh, uh, container. That one, the yellow container, it comes like a, a cream, like it's, it's kind of have a white uh, uh, color and also it's thick. But one thing I don't really like about that particular product is like it's kind of causes white cap, white uh, uh, cast at the end when using it. So, especially when you, if you apply it too much, it gives that white uh, cast. But it's just that it lasts longer, it stays put in the hair than the, the black one, which I will talk about as well. But that white cast that, is give, that it gives, it's why I don't really uh, like it, but it also lasts long. So it's also another, uh, but it's not bad. It's also another uh, beginner friendly the glue that you can also use and it's available is everywhere also the black one the black one is just like a gel uh, it's just like a very thick uh, gel uh, uh, texture and uh, consistency so and it also uh, feel lighter and it's kind of I don't really like the how it sometimes it makes it feels heavy and it doesn't last like I said uh, about the first one it doesn't last like the, the yellow one but I think I kind of prefer it more than the yellow because it doesn't give white cast because that is what I really I prefer using when I was still you know I wear front house more so it's kind of la uh, it kind of doesn't give a, a white cast but it's just that it doesn't really last on the hair and it's talking from experience so if if you sweat a little it's, it's not really heat friendly or sweat friendly so if you sweat for a while uh, after some time it begins to you know pull off it begins to wear off so it doesn't really as uh, it doesn't really hold the um the frontal for a very long time it says i said you, you know you don't have to wear it for days it won't really last like that so it's just very nice when you know you use it for like maybe for a for a day so it doesn't last more than that because before you know it, when you sweat or when you apply oil or something, it pulls off easily. But it's also a good uh, gel to check out, and it's also very very affordable. It may be from three thousand naira to um, six thousand naira. It depends on where you are buying from. I don't know, or it might be more. And also, I, there is fakes too of this uh, uh, got to be gel and a glue, so you have to be careful wherever you are buying it from. Next one I'll be talking about is a BMA glue. So it's the, I think it's one of the first uh, glues that is used, you know, to doubt that when lace glue was still very, very uh, popular to lay uh, to lay frontal or whatever lace uh, uh, lace weed that you want. One thing with uh, BMA is that it's very, very affordable and it's easy to find, but I kind of because during my years of you know working in a salon, that is what my boss uses most of the time to you know make uh, to lay frontal and also to lay uh, uh, lace wigs. So one thing I really I notice about this uh, product is that it's not really uh, beginner friendly. Yes, it's not beginner friendly because it takes time. You know it's takes a, a professional to be able to do it because you have to you know bringing it out from the package you know and also applying it on your hair it takes time so it's not something someone that is you know just starting out to live front time it's not something that I really recommend for you to use because of the time you know of you know applying it on the edges and also the times that you use to you know make it dry before you apply it so it's not a beginner friendly kind of a 
lace glue but it's just that it stay put in the hair and it kind of make the lace it kind of you know feel heavy on the hair so you know when you use it you know that you you know apply something it's not lightweight you know that you apply something on your on your on your edges like you just make your edges very very stiff and uh, strong but it's just that it lasts for a very long time yes it will stay put even if you sweat it stay put and another disadvantage again is that it doesn't really um it doesn't it gives white cast as well so when you apply it if you are not careful especially you apply too much if you don't really know how to use it it also gives you that white cast that you know people will know that you apply something on your uh, edges or your lace uh, glue but it's just that it stayed put it stay old onto the uh, frontal or 360 or whatever you are using to apply uh, you are using it for but it's not a beginner friendly and another thing one thing i like about it is that it's affordable yes so it just really between maybe 1005 or so to be sincere I, I don't really i'm not sure of the price anymore but it's one of the most affordable uh, lace uh, glue that you can get so you can go for it if you come across it or if that is if you you know have the patience or uh, to use it but i just feel that it's not uh, it's not a beginner friendly glue product for your frontal so the next one i'll be talking about is adhesive adhesive also is almost the same thing like a bma that i just mentioned you know it's also very good like it stays put like it will just stay in your air ah. so it's you know if you want something that will stay for you for, for long for like three days one week you can use an sc but i just feel that it's too strong for the for for the edges because after some time if you are not careful it starts pulling off your edges because that is one disadvantages of frontals so if you use products that are too strong it will start pulling off your edges and this product is one of it fine it will last on your it will you know it will make your lace wig or frontal last for a long time but in the process if you are not careful if you if this is something that if you continue to use it it will just finish your edges like as you are pulling it it will be pulling uh, your edges along so i don't really like this pro uh, product like that it's also it's too strong for my liking but it's also very very affordable and it also lasts for a uh, stay old on the uh, hair for a long time so if it's something that you can check you can try it out as well but it's not a favorite of mine so this brings me to the next one and the next one i'm talking about is a ghost bomb like ghost bomb has taken over the market every every big uh, stylist that is what they use because it stays uh, put on the uh, hair it doesn't make the frontal you know to pull off or the 360 to pull off pull off it's sweat friendly is heat friendly you know it stays old for a very long time and it doesn't give white cast it's one product that you will use i know after even, even if it has white and uh, it has white uh, white in color but once you apply it and it melts that's the end you will not even see any traces of uh, you uh, as if you will not even notice if they apply something on uh, you know in styling your frontal or your 360 so it's very very good and also stays put on the uh, makes the frontal last for a very long time but it's just that this product is expensive yes it's not cheap this product you are talking about from maybe nine thousand to i think possibly ten thousand naira but one thing about and it's also very lightweight but one thing about this product like i've been noticing <laughs> for some time is that this product is there are fakes in the market because there are some times that i see two thousand naira on three thousand naira on now like what is this how this cheap this product is so if you see that one of two thousand three thousand is not the original one but the original of this product is around eight to twelve thousand naira but it's not cheap i cannot really specify but the original of this product is not cheap but it's one of the best lace uh, uh, glues in the market this brings me to the next one which is the bold old yes Bold Old also is another very very good lace uh, 
close yeah, lace frontal glue in the market it's all so the same thing like the ghost bomb that i just mentioned it's heat friendly it's um a sweat uh, proof so it doesn't pull off and it lasts for a very long time but it's also very very expensive so if you have the cash of you know buying it you can go ahead and get it but it's worth the price next one i'll be talking about which is the last one is the gorilla nut gel yes gorilla nut gel also is another uh, glue that you can also use to lay your frontal or your 360 but it's just that it doesn't really last uh, for a long time it doesn't you know give the frontal doesn't give it a strong hold but if it's something that you come across or it's something you have or you just need a temporary um product to lay your front out you can try it out it's almost the same it also uh, has a texture like the got to be uh, glue but it doesn't really last for a long time and it's also very very affordable as well so you can try it but i i don't really guarantee it's staying put on uh, you know getting your frontal uh, or 360 lace we well laid these are the glue that you can check out in the market if you come across any of them to you know lay your frontal yourself at home because it saves you the time the stress of you know uh, taking them uh, going to the salon to style them you know, spending a huge amount of money so that's it for this video have you used any of these uh, glues before let me know in the comment section and if you have watched this point and you haven't subscribed to my channel please click the subscribe button to join the family and also click on the notification bell to get notified anytime i post a new video so thank you for watching see you in my next video bye for now